Hey folks, it's Scott, the administrator at Seven Hills Animal Hospital, part of the Pet Village of Seven Hills. Your vet's always insisting you keep your dog's distemper shot up to date, and at this point in time, that means three to four shots when your puppy's about six weeks old, followed by a booster one year later, and then typically a booster every three years for the rest of your dog's life. Making sure your dog gets that distemper shot is one of the most important things you can do for him. Are you saying I have a temper? I'm sorry, I was right in the middle of something. What were you saying? I said, are you saying I have a temper? <laughs> no, no, that's not what I'm saying and that's not what it's for. You try to change my temper and you might find that it gets lost. No, 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 hold on. Hold on just a second. You know, the distemper shot doesn't change your temper. It merely- And what about those who never lose our temper? Why should we be forced to distemper and lose a piece of ourselves just because of brutes like him? That sounds like brainwashing. The temptation is to be tempted to lose our tempers. Let's attempt to temper ourselves and keep our tempers in check temporarily. I think I've heard enough. What about you boys? Oh, hold on a second, guys. Give me just a minute to explain here. You got 10 seconds before I cut them loose. Canine distemper is just what we call a disease that can be deadly in dogs. In fact, 60 years ago, it was the number one killer of our pet dogs, and the shot just keeps you from getting it. Uh, okay. I'm all ears. It's a virus that can cause terrible problems from pneumonia to vomiting and diarrhea to neurological problems to even death. That sounds unpleasant. But I don't like shots. I stay at home anyway, so I don't have to worry about anything like that. Distemper is spread just like other viruses through bodily fluids or secretions from an infected animal through coughing or sneezing, and wildlife can carry it. And if you've never had any neighborhood dogs or wildlife like foxes or raccoons pass through your yard, I'll be really impressed. Plus, the distemper shot also vaccinates you guys against several other really dangerous diseases. All right, Chief. Hey, kid. Yeah, boss? You're volunteering to give this thing a test run. Okay, boss. But if I smell anything funny. Oh, yes, sir. And by the way, distemper is what we call it for short. You may see DHPP or DHLPP on your vet bill, and that's the same thing. These letters just represent the different diseases that you were vaccinated for. Uh, distemper, uh, hepatitis, leptospirosis, parvovirus, and parainfluenza. And if you don't see the L in the DHPP, that just means your dog wasn't vaccinated for lepto. Very small breeds tend to have a higher risk of a reaction to the lepto vaccine. So you especially should be asking your vet about that. Are you about done? Uh, well, oh yeah, well, your vet should perform a comprehensive physical exam before giving the vaccine. It's important that you're healthy before you get it. Well, the kid's back and he seems as ill-tempered as ever. I guess we'll all get it done. Hey, that's great. You know, it's one of the first steps all puppies should take toward leading a long, healthy, and happy life. Thanks for watching. And if you want to keep learning more about pets, vets, and what we think your pet would say if she could talk, please subscribe or check us out on Facebook.